We present the technique for magnifying small motions in the presence of large motions. Current techniques generate significant blurring and clipping artifacts when handling large motions. Our technique magnifies small motions and reduces artifacts significantly over state of the art. In this sequence, we magnify the vibrations of the parking gate. First, we stabilize the input sequence through time. We extract the foreground and the opacity of the examined object. We magnify the foreground and the opacity estimates. And we generate a magnified sequence through image compositing. The magnified sequence, however, contains black holes revealed by the amplified motions. We use texture synthesis to fill those black holes. Finally, we dewarp the magnified sequence back to the original space-time coordinates. Euler magnification generates very blurry results. YouTube stabilization with Euler also generates blurry results. Low motion compensation plus Euler magnification does not amplify motions of interest. After Effects stabilization followed by Euler magnification generates artifacts around the region of interest. It also magnifies stabilization errors. Here we show the original sequence of a person holding a light bulb. Our magnification reveals a temporal light change caused by the alternating electrical current. Euler and YouTube generate clipping artifacts while Lagrangian generates noisy results. This sequence shows a person moving his eye. Note that we can hardly see the eye microsaccades in the original sequence. Our technique clearly magnifies the microsaccades of the eye. Euler generates noticeable blurring artifacts, while Lagrangian generates noisy results. This sequence shows the shadow of a cameraman. Here the cameraman is placing his hand on his shoulder and he's moving it up and down. Our technique magnifies the small hand movement. Euler and YouTube, however, generate strong blurry artifacts. This sequence shows small water vibrations at the top of a bottle. Our technique magnifies such vibrations. In this sequence, we magnify the movement of the leaves. When a person shoots a gun, his arm moves. However, this movement is small and hence hard to see. Our technique magnifies such arm movement. In this sequence, After Effects generates inaccurate stabilization. This leads to magnification artifacts. We now present our experiments in controlled environments. We generate this sequence by adding a small vibration to the white circle. We then add a global motion and we process the resulting sequence using different magnification techniques. 
Our technique resembles the ground truth magnification. Note that some artifacts here are generated by the VD compression. After Effects generates poor stabilization, which leads to strong blurring artifacts. Next, we examine the guitar sequence from the Euler magnification paper. In this sequence, the strings of a guitar are vibrating. However, the vibration is too small to be seen. We take this sequence and we add a global motion. We then process the resulting sequence with different magnification techniques. Our technique reveals the vibration of the strings, which is very similar to the ground truth. Directly applying Euler magnification to the moving sequence, however, generates significant blurring artifacts. Finally, after effects stabilization errors get magnified. This generates a shaky magnified sequence. Thanks for your time.